Hello everyone, thank you for joining me today. How y'all doing? This is Yusuf Chaudhry, digital marketing coach here in San Antonio, Texas. Hey, what's going on, Rush? So I'm gonna do a quick review on this awesome, it's like a credit card, it's called Coin. I don't know if, uh, if you can read it, Coin, okay? So, <laughs> thank you for joining, thank you John. I'm just gonna do a quick review because I've been waiting on this. It was a startup company that I knew about them I believe last year, and I made a pre-order for this. It's like a credit card, okay? Hey, Valerie, how are you? So basically what it is, you can add, I think, unlimited cards in one card. So I have right here, if I press on, okay, see? I'm going to click like that. And uh, come on. Let's see. So basically what happens... Finally, yeah, finally, I, I, <laughs> Rocket, did you get it too? Yeah, it's a one card that can fit in multiple cards. That's what it is. So I can add as many cards of this one credit card, okay? So instead of having, you know, three, four cards swiping it, hey, what's up? I can use this one, one card to basically swipe it through different, uh, you know, hey, hey, what's going on? So I'm just doing a quick review. So right here, as you can see, uh, this is my... If I, if I if I click on this, like this is kind of click on it. Now it changed to my personal credit card or my business. So I can switch it by clicking on the card. So when I swipe it, it can I can pick which card I want. So you can add multiple debit card and credit card and use this one. It's really inconvenient. It's very really convenient actually. So it's called uh, Coin. When I bought it uh, as a pre-order, it used to be forty, I think fifty dollars, but right now it's hundred bucks. So if you go to OnlyCoin.com. You can get this. It's very inconvenient. It comes with an app. It's not a Bitcoin. It's a credit card that you can put all your card, Ervin. You can add you can add all your credit cards or debit card in one card. Then you can basically use it like a, like a swipe in it or like an NFC with one hit. <laughs> I'm here, Bobby. Weekends. At, uh, I think on Saturday I did a um, scope like almost like all day long. Okay. It's not a website. It's called Only Coin. You download an app, but you have to order this it comes with a swipe okay let me show you it comes with a swipe only coin yeah thank you only coin so what will happen you plug this to your phone and let's say grab any of my you know cards and swipe it take a snapshot then uh, no it's just like a card just like a regular card see just like, a, like any credit card so you swipe it and take a picture and of course into the last three digits and sync it with this and you can have multiple and the cool thing about this i mean it has like a, some sort of battery thin battery inside you can't even feel it it lasts for two years here we go it lasts for two years okay it lasts for two years so if the battery dies uh you will get a message and you can reorder another one okay so it's pretty cool it's very 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 convenient so what happened when I got this first time, in their message, they were saying that there's a possibility that it might not work in some places. So there is a map. When you click on the map, it shows you, you know, set on the stand. It shows you all the, the location of businesses that can actually take this. And there's a message. So you can go to any business. It says, will they take a coin or not? So you, you test it. If it takes it, you can go back to the app and say, yes, they actually take it. From understanding, I think most places will take it anyway. Uh, we can try, can we, can we, yeah, it's awesome, I'm telling you, one card, I can have three, four cards in one card, so I can swipe it, just like using a regular card, actually, it was released like two, three months ago, already, okay, so to set up, it's very easy, all you have to do, you plug this to your phone, then, you basically can Swipe your card. <laughs> I'm not gonna show you. Oh, you're gonna try to steal that, huh? Okay, so you have to provide one coin uh, once you get card number through the website. No, no, what you do, you download, you, you sign up with the website, you download the app on your phone. Once you get this, okay, once you get this, you swipe your card and take a snapshot with the camera, with the with the phone camera. Then enter the information like the zip code and the and the last three digit then sync it. So when you sync it, what you have to do, there is a circle button here. You're supposed to, you know, make sure your Bluetooth on your phone is on. So press and hold it until this area says sync. When it says sync, that's it. That means, <laughs> I do gonna do that. That means you are going to, uh, 
what do you call it? Have the card synced. I mean, it's, I'm telling you, it's very easy to set up, and you can you can use it any places. I mean, at first when I looked at the map, it says maybe this place will take them or not. Double check, but I just went to my neighbor's restaurant right here. It was pretty nice and sweet. Yeah, I mean, the Apple Pay. The thing with the Apple, you have Apple. Hope someone in the other room isn't syncing right along with you. Okay. Uh, yes, Discover American Express. Any it will take any card. Okay. So check out only. Uh, coin.com check it out there's an awesome video and explain how this thing works. I'm pretty excited I mean now I can just probably carry one thing and not worry about having you know multiple cards because I can have my business card in one I can have my personal my you know card for my team does that make sense now with, with Apple pay I mean you have to use the mobile device this is just like a regular credit card does that make sense it's like a regular debit card so you can use it anywhere I'm so much a lot of stuff like that. Well, you gotta give it a shot, right, Bobby? You just know Yusuf has a big. <laughs> yes, I do. So I gotta have one for the team, one for myself, one for the family. So now I can just have it in one place. This is not a sponsored message. I'm just using this and I'm liking it. I'm sharing with you all because I'm sure you all, as a business owner, sometimes we look for inconvenience. Uh, I believe it, they said on the website that it is uh, what you call it uh, NFC. What is it that? Uh, Compatible. It doesn't have the the chip yet, but what, what, what they were saying that it's an EMV NFC ready coin 2.0 EMV NFC ready. I can also just you know kind of you know hit on the any device and we'll take the payment. So if you go to what does the shirt say? Oh, the shirt. That's what the shirt say. You like it? <laughs> okay. No, onlycoin.com. Funk Master, go to onlycoin.com. Okay, onlycoin.com, yes. Uh, thank you. So, I mean, I've been waiting for this when it came out, I believe, I think last year. It was a startup company. They were pre-ordering ordering it. Hey, Ray, what's going on, man? I was just doing a quick review on, uh, you know, OnlyCoin, where you can add all your credit card, your debit card in one place. And if you want to pay, you just have to hit the circle, and it changes what card you're going to use. Wait to get one in about five years after I see how the company conducts itself. <laughs> What's up, brother? What's up, Ray? What's going on, man? Good to see you, bro. So, anyway, I, I tested it. I got it uh, a few days ago, and I tested it today. It works pretty, pretty, pretty well. Yeah, friend, did you see the plastic surgery scope? That <laughs> Thanks, man. So, yeah, this is pretty cool. I just tested it today, and to set it up is very easy. Just make sure that you're, uh, you don't have to uh, log in to the app on the mobile device. Once it's set up, you can log out. It doesn't matter. But if you want to log in to make, you know, update the maps, you can tell other only coiners, hey, in this place it works, you can do that. But the setup is very easy. Just, like I said, um, get to watch the whole thing. Yes, it is very interesting. If you get a chance, go to onlycoin.com. So to set up is very easy. You just plug this on your phone, swipe the card, take a snapshot, put your zip code, put your three, you know, the, the last three digits, and sync. So when you sync, you gotta make sure that you hold this circle right here. You hold it until it says sync, and that's it. Then it's gonna sync the card. And you can add multiple, I think you can add multiple cards as much as, as, much as you can. And I'm almost kind of concerned because this thing has a power. This thing has, it's, it's a digit. Does that make sense? It's like a digital system where it's a sync and your number. So I was wondering, how does, how, what is the life? What is the, what's the battery life? And I looked at the website, at the Q&A, and they said, well, it lasts for two years. So. If you use it normally, I don't know what it normally means, but uh, if, even if the battery expires, I think you're going to get some sort of notification so you can get another one. Yes, my Rita shows up because I'm in my office. So uh, if you want to hang out with me, just uh, bring some pizza. <laughs> okay, so I just want to do a quick review. I mean, I, I enjoyed it. I liked it. That's why I'm showing it to you. I have no affiliation. I mean, even though they, they might have an affiliate program, maybe I should sign up. If anyone's interested, let me know so I, can give, so I can send you the affiliate link. So I can make some extra cash. <laughs> okay? Yeah, I, I gotta make some money too, right? That was the question I asked earlier about the battery life. Yes, but the battery life, according to them, it lasts for two years. Isn't that amazing? And if it doesn't, it will let you know so you can reorder another one. So I'm not sure if you have to pay again if you reorder. I don't think you, you don't have to because you already purchased it. But we'll see. We'll find out. Good pizza outside the office. Yeah, Marcus Pizza is very good right here in the corner. <laughs> yeah, pay with the card. <laughs> Uh, what happens after two years? I do not know. Great question. Maybe I should ask them. You know, maybe I should ask them. So it's a brand new. And please, if you go to their website, uh, in fact, you guys want to see the the original the original video that came out. 
Uh, let's see, I have been working uh, on new teleport listing idea. Only if you guys want to see the original, there's two videos right now on the website, but if you want to see the original commercial, I can go and show to you. You seem well rested and you're uh, and happy today. I like him. Uh, really? <laughs> Do I look like very tired? I'm still tired. <laughs> show the card. Show the card. Show the card. Man. Here's the card. Okay? It's called coin. So you can just press this to change different cards. What is only coin card? It's a card where you can put multiple cards in one card, Barry. That's what it's for. It's awesome. It's convenient. I like it. Okay? If y'all want to see the old uh, video for this, let me know so I can show it to you on YouTube right now. Is it thicker? No, actually, it's exactly like a regular card. I mean, look. I mean, the thickness is the same. See? It's the same. Okay? Yeah, you can take this. You can take a snapshot. Yeah, go and steal it. <laughs> okay. Yep. Let's see the video. Let me go and put the video right now. This was the... The first video when it came out. So let me show you. And these are the same. These I don't think in, I don't think they have international yet. Uh, what happens if you lose it? Well, guess what? I'm gonna save my car somewhere else, right? <laughs> I thought about that too. Like, oh my car is gone, so you. Mm, let me go back to my locker. What I put my old cards, right? <laughs> okay. Um, let me show you this thing real quick. Let me pick it up here. Oh, uh, 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 uh. All right. So this is the the original video like i think this is the i think one of the I don't, i'm not sure if i want to find it but these same guys they actually made another project called the grid for website but check it out making sure here to tell you about coin it solves a problem i think most of us have see my wallet is filled with cards credit cards debit cards rewards cards gift cards filled with them too many yeah if i forget the card it will send me a notification a like hey pick up your card it's a simple card just like a regular payment card you can swipe it just like any other card the difference between a coin and any other card all these cards are inside my coin yes it was the grid bobby for stuff with any it's called the grid for another commercial for like a website stuff my coin has all the same data and acts just like my debit card would when i swipe it this is a business lunch so I'm going to expense it on the business card. I just tap this button to select okay. the right card, and that's it. How do I get my cards in my coin, you're asking? It's a fair question. I use this thing and the coin app to swipe them in. Take a picture so I know which one it is, and that's it. Oh, security. This is cool, too. Let's say you pay with your coin, you've got a lot on your mind, you leave your coin behind, like a dummy. See that? The coin uses a low-power Bluetooth signal that knows when your phone is near and when it's not. In this card, all your cards. You can add as many as you want, and it stays the same size. And all you ever need is one. One coin for all your cards. Just go to onlycoin.com right there onlycoin.com and you can order it from there see that 100 bucks i bought it for like i think 45 when they came out before pre-order yeah there's another video right here see that bulge in my pants that's my wallet insurance card credit cards debit cards library cards gift card membership not yet it's a brand new business, checking so. AAA, metro card a bunch of things i don't need coin is a company that makes one card for all of your cards that is, all of your cards become one. But first I had to see if it would work. Yep, it works. Okay, cool. So let's see if it actually works for me for a whole week. Wednesday, I left my office, took a taxi to the airport, and flew to Los Angeles to make a music video. I rented a car, had dinner with a friend, lent location scout. Tried to hold the camera while gassing up the car at the same time. Thursday. Figured out casting okay, down okay, shootout, don't. milky goat, rented lights, rented camera, trucks, wardrobe, props, bought food for the crew. More gas, more coffees. 
finished the video, took the drug for drinks, got an enormous plate of nachos, which nobody ate. Tried to fly back to New York, but the storm pushed the flights, and I went to Philadelphia instead. Took a train in the city and took the subway home. Coin, Send me a direct message, okay? On uh, Twitter. Yeah, anyway. I was wondering how you do that myself, so I checked out the coin headquarters and got schooled on swiping. The coin's been developing a super thin battery and Bluetooth signal for the last three years, along with a magnet that safely represents all of your cards and functions with all kinds of card machines. Look at all those swipers. Friday, flew to Mexico City to see my girlfriend. Drove out to the Costa Esmeralda, where we just happened to have an entire hotel to ourselves, except for two dogs. Great question. I'll answer off the videos, though. Monday, back to New York for more editing, more coffee on the gift card, a lot of places that are cash only, more subways, more taxis, rented gear on my Amex, bought hard drives on my Visa, late soccer. Tuesday, went to the mountains to shoot a ski video with an old friend. Bought breakfast on my MasterCard, bought sunscreen on my Visa, rented skis, boots, poles, got a lift ticket, and charged it all on my coin. Then, had my friend hold it while doing all these tricks. Yes, they are, actually. I think this month is the month where everyone's going to have a chip. Ditched those, got rid of all these, forgot about those, kept this. Get that. Thanks, Queen. All right, back to the question. <laughs> okay. First of all, when people say, what about the waitress, you know, clicking on the thing? Well, if you click on the thing, you're not going to have the full number. It's going to only show just the four digit. Does that make sense? So it's not going to show the full, you know, the 16 number, whatever. And so they're not going to see the, 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 the three, what do you call it? The uh, the three digit. Does that make sense? And plus, why would somebody you know flip the card to to charge you? Makes no sense. Unless if they're pissed off, then they can probably flip the <laughs> flip the the card and charge a lot of money on all of them if they know what it is. Does that make sense? So they developed this last year. It just came out. I think something when it was scared. I think we should just give it a try and see what happens. I'll I'll take the risk. You know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, it's not like with the regular card. With the regular card, I mean, if you just use a piece of paper, right? You can just put the card here and just use a pencil. There you go, it's done. People can steal like that because you need the full number, not just the four digits. Does that make sense? And of course, the, the, the three digits on the back. So this one, you, you cannot do that because this card itself uh, doesn't show that. It will only show you, like, like even on the back, you don't see anything on the back. There's no three digit number, anything. Does that make sense? When I click on my uh, you know, personal or business, it will just show the last, uh, it, will, it will call it personal. Or business and maybe the last four digit that's it does that make sense so I understand when it comes to security you are the first adapter you love to be at the top <laughs> I have to man you know for the for the for the business I mean this much uh, I only use one card and it's it, it has a fraud protection yeah plus remember your card that you get it from your bank I mean they have a fraud protection does that make sense I mean yeah I mean I also have I don't have protection too but this is just a tool to kind of ease up the process. And I'm sure they thought about it before they released it. I mean, they sold, like, according to them, they sold, like, more than 300000 already. So that's like, you know, you can do the math. I mean, to me, I think we as a business sometimes, yes, we look for an easy way of doing things. I think this is pretty cool. If they made the button uh, a fingerprint reader, it would be better. You know, that, that, that'd be cool. That'd be cool. That's true, Barry. But, you know, again, it's awesome. It's the first time it came out. I was happy. I got it. I've been using it. I'm, I'm going to keep using it to see how it turns out because so I can, you know, uh, shrink my wallet. I need some time to see work out the kind before I give it. <laughs> you can wait, no problem, man. The one, I was wondering one thing though. I'm like, man, if my wallet is so thin, that means I won't even figure it out or remember if my wallet was lost or not. Anyway, but the cool thing about this card, uh, I, the one thing I didn't test, if you leave it, let's say, on, on, the, on the table and you walk a certain distance, your phone's gonna beep. It will say, hey, you forgot your card, go get it back, and there's a GPS. See? Does any card does that for you? <laughs> I'd rather pay twice. So I think with this way, I don't think they can steal it because the number is not there. Uh, but uh, and the cool thing is, for secure reason, it can track. So if I if I forget my card, it will it will it will send you a beep. Like you know, I don't know, I haven't tested. I'm gonna test and let you know how it goes. But it will, it's gonna send you a beep sound to tell you you forgot your uh, card somewhere. Yes, the chip will replace, but the issue with the chip, a lot of businesses, I'm not sure that they're, they're going to switch it too. Does that make sense? I mean, of course they have to. When that comes, then of course they're going to come with it too, because even Square offers a chip now. You know, even Square offers the, the chip versions. I might get that pretty soon as well.
You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, anyway, so that was a cool thing. I like it. I share with you guys. If any questions, let me know. Check out the website. See what you think. And if this is something, you know, uh, convenient for you, and give it a shot. Uh, and this one has that. This one, it says EMV NFC uh, compatible. So, I'm, I'm, of course, I have to think about it. I'm, otherwise, how can they sell it? Uh, I need to stay up on things like this. Yes, man. A lot of cool stuff out there. A lot of technology. You'd be surprised. So many cool stuff out there that can actually ease our process of running our business too. And life sometimes. You're welcome. Yeah, who carries cash? Even though sometimes you have to, right? I mean, I sometimes do try to, you know, carry cash, but who does it these days? It's kind of scary too. <laughs> you know, you think about it, like, right? But yeah, so you got on your phone. You can pay through your phone. You can pay through this one card. You never carry cash, right? Even if I don't be like, you know, just gotta show up, like, you know, like, make it rain. <laughs> I had to get changed. You sound better. Than you did last week. Yes, uh, after having um, a lot of, uh, what do you call it, a sore throat and a headache, and now, hey, Eddie, what's going on? Good to see you, man. $5 only. I'm just going to use uh, Facebook advertising. <laughs> I forgot the affiliate link yet. $5 for $100 sale. Come on, coin, you're cheap. If, you want, if anybody wants to buy it, I will make an affiliate link and I send it to you. Okay. But if you go to their website, they have a lot of, uh, what you call it, they have a lot of, Q under the Q&A, they have a lot of questions. Uh, <laughs> no, man. So, yeah, if you go to the, the Frequently Asked Question, they have tons of topic there. You check it out. It's awesome. Uh, let's see. How does Collins Referral Program work? Yeah, 90 days, pre-order, right out of Okay, cool. Not bad. But I just put it on a Facebook ad and just get it from there. Make some extra cash. If I pay a dollar, I mean five bucks, I'll do it. That's the only reason Yusuf still needs to carry a <laughs> dollar bill. Something I do, man. You never know. Somebody about need help, you know. Not meant for business, meant for actual people that need help. You never know. <clears throat> Thank you for the hearts, everyone. If you enjoyed this, you know, click on number 15 right here and uh, share it in Twitter and Facebook. Really appreciate it. Okay. So yeah, check it out. If you if you like this, you know, check it out. I mean, I like it. I was like, ooh, I was like very happy. Like, ah. Until I get, you know, probably something bad happened. <laughs> then I'll share that with you too. Hey guys, this didn't work. So yeah, it was very easy to set up. It took me like probably, you know, uh, two or three minutes maximum. Okay. Pen handlers. Yeah, and plus, you know, you can store all your cards. So even if your wallet is stolen with only coin, Probably they wouldn't figure out how to use it. <laughs> and you have the original card somewhere else. Saved. And you can go ahead and cancel it. You, we, you were blasting those debates the other day. Which one? Which, which debate? Maybe the price will go down by the time I get one. It's possible. Because when we, when we got it, I, think, I believe it was like $45 or $49. And it was a pre-order. So this smart company, startup company, they did a video. They talked about it. They collected all this money. Then they produced it. Can you believe it? <laughs> that was smart. Oh, that stuff? I don't know. I, I, I stay away from those, um, from those uh, stuff. Those are not for intelligent people. <laughs> those debate are not productive, so stay away from them. <clears throat> well, if I do, then it has to be a sincere one-on-one, -on -one, uh, heart to heart, uh, pre-order for like, for, yeah, order for like a year. It was, it was, it wasn't in Kickstarter, but it was similar. It was similar, so we ordered directly from their website. I was doing a class on uh, mobile entrepreneur. Basically, I was sharing a bunch of apps for, as a business owner, what kind of apps you need to have. And I'm telling you, this was like a long, long time ago. <clears throat> that's a good question, I don't know. I can ask them if they have a, a fraud protection plan. I can ask them, I don't know, but that's a good question though. Let me write it down. Thank you. Yeah, I just want to share with you guys, I mean, just want to share. I mean, like I said, I enjoyed it. It's pretty cool, and uh, I can, you know, switch from card to card. It's just a matter of convenience. When I was at the restaurant, they're like, "Oh, wow, this is cool." Even the even the owner was like, "Whoa, this is awesome." He was like, "This is convenient. This is very convenient." 
I have a blab account, but I haven't used it. I've been a guest in blog or I jump into blog, but I haven't actually used it myself. Like I haven't created like a, some sort of uh, event. I joined with Ray Garcia. He did a couple of blab shows and Saad from uh, Block Tech. Am I scoping tonight? I'm actually not sure. I have some project to work on. I would say 50% chance I'm going to scope. If I do, then of course it's going to be on SEO because I have to follow up with... Uh, Let's blab. You wanna blab? Let's blab right. Let's blab right now, Irvin. You wanna blab? Let's do it right now. <laughs> That's how we do it. Take action. Yeah, blab is out. If you wanna do it, Irvin, go ahead and start right now, and I'll be there. Yeah. <clears throat> Ready? Do it. Do it. Do it now. And I'll be there. Let's do it right now. I'm gonna go to blab. Blab. And let's do it. Let's talk about some cool stuff, man. All right, do it. So Irvin, this guy, so of course, Ray is an awesome guy. You should follow him. And Irvin is another awesome guy. You should follow him. Those are two, those, two of them are my brothers from another mother. <laughs> my brothers. Yeah, Irvin, you should follow Ray because Ray is awesome. Hey, Ray, are you going to scoop tonight? Are you going to scoop tonight, Ray? All right, folks. Who, uh, let's all, yeah, let's, let's blab it, baby. Blabbing time. Yes, I'm scoping my Monday show. <laughs> oh, the, the, don't be a red dot. Don't be a red dot, yeah. All right, so, so Urban's going to start a blab. Hey, Ray, if you have time, I know you're probably with your family right now. If you can jump in, that'll be super sweet. People have been asking for, yeah, let's do it, man. I'm all about just doing it at the moment, just right now. Because, you know, I got to do it right now because I have a lot of stuff to work on. I might do multitasking, like, you know, watching the blab and work on some stuff. Who's ready? Who's ready for a blab so we can have a good topic? Okay, he wants to do it for five minutes. <laughs> okay. I've never started one. Just do it, man. Come on, Irvin, you can do it. It'd be easy for you. You can do it while you sleep. Close your eyes and just imagine. Blab, go to blab.im. You can open your desktop, your laptop. I, I prefer if you do it from your laptop. It's much easier. It's like a, it's like a hangout, basically. You, know, you can have four people in one screen. <laughs> Look at it, Urban. He will, he's asking Ray to start. No, man, you need to start. Let's talk about a uh, conversation on maybe... Um, uh, uh, maybe a tech stuff like how uh, what kind of app app we use to for our business. Okay, maybe we can talk about I don't know, discussion different topic or maybe it's just gonna be maybe it's just gonna be just different you know open discussion about anything that uh, Irvin talked about or Ray or anybody else. So go ahead, go ahead, Irvin. I, I'm looking at Blab, man. I don't see anything, man. I'm at Blab. I am. I don't see anything from you. What's going on? Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Come on. Do it now. Oh, I see that all things mm, fatherly. Okay, you did that before. <laughs> okay. That was like in August, right? Yeah, I told you that. Yeah. Me and, that's, how, that's how we do it, man. I put that in the spot. Come on, bro. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Uh, okay, let's ask the audience. What do you guys want, what do you guys want us to talk about? Uh, uh, let, let the audience decide. What should we talk about? It's because Urban is going to start a blab right now. So what should we talk about? Is it going to be tech? Uh, is it going to be like tech, technical, uh, technology re related, internet marketing related? Peer pressure, <laughs> All right? Uh, not sure. It happens to me in different rooms. Looking into it to see if it's a bug. So tech product, online marketing, social media, Q and A. You guys want to ask a question? Maybe me and Ray and uh, Urban gonna give you the answers. Come on, just. You, you folks, let us know what topic would you like. <clears throat> Where is everyone? <laughs> Got quiet now. What is that? A-U-A. Hmm. That's not good, man. Usually lasts for weeks. I've heard. Okay, Henry. <laughs> hey, Erwin, what, what were we supposed to talk about last time when you were talking about landing pages? We had a couple of questions. People are asking a couple of questions. Do I have any questions? Maybe you can answer those questions. 
Ask us anything tech. Mar okay, there you go. That should be top. Ask us anything about tech and marketing and business. There you go. Let's do that. Let's do it. Do it now. I got a couple of questions too. Can you can you scope the blab? You mean where to go for that? Let me show you. So basically, just go to blab blab dot im. Okay, it's much easier. I mean, there is an app for it for the phone, but it's much easier if you just go to blab dot im. Maybe type Irvin his name, and then he might if he started it, he might show up. Can't even type. <laughs> My son wants to make a Periscope account but doesn't have a Twitter account. I advise him to start a Twitter account to be honest. Okay? Okay? Alright. <clears throat> I prefer... Uh, you saw I've been, I've, been, I've been to play at one of those sessions. I prefer he opens a uh, Twitter account because it will help him... I mean, it will be beneficial if you have a Twitter account. That's my advice. I mean, you can do without the Twitter account, but how can you share it and all the stuff? You know what I'm saying? So I prefer that way you can have you can hit two stones with two two stones two stones with one shoe. <laughs> what? What? All right, Irvin, that was a good topic. Ask us anything about tech, marketing, and business, and let's go. Let's go, man. I like that. I like I love how Irvin comes with this. And I got a couple of questions people asking here. Somebody asked me on Twitter, Yusuf, is it better to have a blog post or a page on your WordPress website? I can answer this question. I've been, I have been to Blab on one of the, yes, awesome, awesome. Come on, okay, come on, come on, where are you? Did you start? Did you start? There you go. All right, folks, go to blab.im and do a search for Urban. There you go. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna end this thing.